Hey guys, Ethan here from Mint Equipment. Uh, I just wanted to shoot a quick video today on this Kubota BX23S. Um, this tractor only has 40 hours on it, um, and it's a 2021, so it pretty much has all the warranty remaining on it. Um, it's just a really nice tractor. Of course, it only has 40 hours, but I wanted to point out a few of the things um, about this backhoe model specifically. Um, I don't see these very often, but start up here in this box um, it is an option from Kubota to get the three-point hitch kit so I still have all of the three-point hitch components um, I took them out of the original box because they were wet from being uh, transported here but they've never been installed on the tractor and they're uh, in very nice shape still uh, also you can see this tractor is optioned with this bolt-on cutting edge um, this is just something that you can option from Kubota. So um, they did utilize the factory holes that were drilled in the bucket. Um, and this is just a little protection against some extra wear. It's a couple hundred bucks extra uh, from Kubota, I think. Uh, so this tractor is pretty much fully optioned out. It also has this skid steer quick attach bucket. So we can just pull a lever here on each side and you can pop the bucket off the tractor and put on a set of forks or if you wanted to a grapple bucket. Uh, you can see it's kind of got, it has a different design of brush guard in comparison with uh, the standard BX tractors. One of the nice things that I did notice about this new backhoe model um, that Kubota hasn't previously put on their tractors is that we have these chain hooks on the back here if you ever trailered one of these you know there's not a very there's no real good spot on the back of the tractor to uh, tie the tractor down without using these steps or going around the backhoe itself here but now we have some nice um, metal rings here that you can hook a set of straps on or put some chains around this tractor has a 16 inch backhoe bucket on it this is the biggest bucket you can get for this tractor so probably not ideal for trenching but uh, you could move a lot of material pretty quickly with this as it does have the larger bucket now taking something from the older Kubota BX backhoe models they've gone back to this kind of clamshell uh, design here on the backhoe this is something that I really missed on some of the backhoes like the BX25 and the 25D where they just have the pin. Those backhoes can be difficult to remove because you need to get the backhoe in the perfect position to where all the weight is removed off of the attaching pins. Um, with this clamshell design it's much easier to remove the weight off of them and then flip the lever and unlatch it from the tractor. If you are a tall person, you know, you're six feet tall or so, you might want to consider a backhoe model just because the seat height is a bit higher on the backhoe because you do have a swivel seat frame in here that adds maybe an inch and a half or two inches of height to the seat. Um, so it is a lot more comfortable, I feel like, being raised up higher. And you also notice that Kubota has raised the steering wheel. Um, so this is also uh, in a comfortable position. Uh, this lever might possibly be taller, but the rest of these are still a little bit low here. Aside from that, guys, that's really all I have to say about this tractor. It's a 2021, so it has a warranty until I think uh, 2027 on the powertrain. Uh, it's in great shape. If you want to save a little money off of a new version, uh, we got this one here uh, up for sale for $22,000 out the door. That includes sales tax for... Uh, Michigan residents but anyways guys thanks for watching if you got any thoughts on these BX backhoe tractors leave them in the comments below uh, you can find us at mintequipment.com uh, my phone number is 616-747-1311 uh, we're in Rockford Michigan but anyways guys thanks for watching the video I'll see you in the next one